Hey everybody, this is Mike with Accounting for Cycling. Today we'll be unboxing and checking out the Sennheiser Conversation Clear Plus True Wireless Hearing Solution. So I actually have, and this is not a sponsored video, but I did receive this as a member of Best Buy's Tech Insider program. As a member of this invitation only program, I am provided with products for the purposes of writing honest, unbiased reviews. So I did not purchase this, uh, but Sennheiser and Best Buy did send this to me. Uh, to test out, review, and see how it works. So, we'll uh, you know, break out the new Gerber um, and cut this tape, but the uh, eagle-eyed of you may see the tape's already cut. Um, I actually decided after I had cut the tape open and pulled the top of the box off that I was going to do an unboxing. There we go. Well, right off the bat, and this is something that I really like that uh, Sennheiser and a lot of these companies have done is uh, your control is all set through the app, kind of like most modern earbuds and headphones. So they just right off the bat, right on top, before you see anything else, download the app. You can see some of the benefits here. So this is the little guy here. So we've got the ear adapter sets with small, medium. I'm guessing there's probably some already attached on there. Ear fins, which are usually optional. Uh, just kind of helps keep the bud in your ear. USB-C cable, because you know, we've all got those, except the non-converted Apple folks yet. Um, soon, once you've got an iPhone 15, um, or an iPad or a recent MacBook, then you do. Ooh, quick start guide uh, with pictures, which is kind of nice. So we'll set that there. And uh, here's the actual earbuds here, or hearing aids, not earbuds. They are buds that go in your ear. So here's the fin kit. Here are the different tips. The USB-C cable, which is seems to be pretty lengthy, 100 centimeter, okay. So one meter cable, so or 3.3 feet. Freedom units. Okay, so here it is. Just like a little pebble. USB-C charging port on the bottom here. Let's see if this does the cool slide. No, flips. That's still nice and easy to open. And shows the hearing aids right inside here. Well, that's downloading and verifying by Play Protect. We'll just kind of go over some features. So the biggest thing with the Conversation Clear and uh, the All Day Clear, which are these guys, look more like traditional hearing aids, except it's got all the uh, mic pickups in the ear instead of up here, uh, so your glasses don't scratch on them. Uh, we'll go ahead and sell our sole here. Excellent. All right, so we're in. These hearing aids, uh, they feature automatic scene detection. So whether it's noisy, quiet, music, uh, different conversations going on. It'll be able to automatically switch to the best mode. So they'll automatically switch to the best mode for the environment. I think it told on me. All right, so now we're gonna try that again. We are going to take both earbuds out. And after I threw it on a charger very quickly, you can see the LED lights in the case. The one on front indicating that there is power. Take them out. I see green flashing lights, not blue. There they go. And I'm just connecting here off camera. And so it's going to take a moment to connect with the app. I'm let's see parent request. We will pair. And the nice thing uh, about the Sennheiser apps is they make it really easy to use, easy to operate. So you don't have to be really tech savvy. Uh, even though Sennheiser is mostly known for you know, good quality audio. Uh, which I can definitely attest that the all-day clears sound excellent when you're listening to music through phone calls, um, and I would definitely expect kind of the same thing here. All right, place and position the earbuds in both ears. So we'll place some position in each ear. So you want to start kind of with this strip pier thing pointed down and then turn to lock them in place. Um, and in case you've ever wondered, that is actually how you're supposed to insert pretty much any kind of earbud, uh, it's just like that. And so immediately, like I haven't done anything, I've just gotten to this point in the setup, and I can already hear the ampl amplification that uh, is already blocking out the noise from the fan I have running, the ace, or the, not AC, just the uh, whole house fan that's blowing through the vents. And it's already starting to isolate those noises out. 
and focus more on just noises uh, or focusing on voices, uh, any sort of music that might be around, which right now there's none, so it's actually kind of uh, quiet. Part of the automatic scene detection system is it's supposed to go through the different sound modes, whether you're listening to uh, uh, music streaming through here, um, crowded environments, trying to block out that excess noise that um, I know I suffer a lot with when I'm in a crowded environment. There's a lot going on, a lot of noises. Uh, it really makes it hard for me to actually hear anybody. Usually I can't hear anything, and that's kind of noticeable by I'll be doing like, and basically all I'm hearing is boom, boom. And yeah, let's continue through with the setup here. Doesn't feel comfortable. Ensure the ear adapters are the correct size. So they actually came with the large plugs in, and you have the medium and small inside of here. So if you don't have the right ones, just pull them off. Uh, same thing with these wingtip things, or you can go with the one that has none. Um, I might actually switch to that. I'm not always a fan of those like wingtip in the ear thing, um, but so far it seems pretty steady. Um, I'll, use, I'll take these out for a run uh, just to kind of see how they work out. Um, I did a half marathon with the all-day clears um, and a, an Olympic duathlon with these in. Um, so, along with quite a few other running things, so as long as they don't uh, slap if they're not perfectly in, like the HPs do, um, which that is solved by, you change these little wingtip things. Uh, you put in the correct one and it solves the slap, slap, slap issue uh, for my summer fast run vlog. And we'll click through here, look at that, we're all set up, nice and easy. So I'll ask you, do you hear music? I do. Excellent placement, not complete, it's kind of a jam too. All right, so what it'll do is it's actually going to then go through more setup of tailoring the sound directly to me. And so it takes you through adjusting the volume to different levels, seven being the loudest, one being the quietest, like the three. And now these are, I'm sure, I think just different presets. Yeah, there we go. Now they're applying my personal sound profile. So that's Pretty quick, easy setup right there. Um, they feel comfortable in the air, and yeah, isn't that really kind of what you're looking for if you're trying to find a hearing assistive device? Accurately detected. I am in a quiet environment, uh, but now we can boost this for clarity boost. We'll focus more on human voices. Uh, streaming, if you're streaming music, there's nothing playing right now. Um, that's active noise canceling. All right, <laughs> we're gonna change that. But so they feel comfortable in here. They don't look too ridiculous. So, I mean, it just looks like I'm wearing a small pair of earbuds. There we go. Uh, just kind of looks like I'm wearing a small pair of earbuds and uh, feel similar to it too. They're not shaking around, they're not moving around. Again, I'll test these out on a run instead of in my office chair, um, just to kind of see how they do hold up to a good movement test. All right, so I will take these out. Ooh, and now it's quiet again. So the actual individual buds here, you know, contain, this is just how you pop off and replace the ear tips. Boy, no, attention. No, I don't want to close the app. I'm just accidentally calling up Google Assistant. Oblong. There we go. All right, just took a little bit of finesse. All right, I don't know what those do. So, you know, very small earbuds. Uh, just kind of take a trip through the app. We've got the stream setting here. Um, so if you do have music or say a YouTube video streaming, uh, you'll be able to hear that nice and clear through here. Uh, good audio, really good audio quality too. Relax mode sets your active noise canceling and you can set how much of the outside world you wanna hear, um, either by using this plus and minus, which goes in 10% 10, 10 increments, or by dragging the dial, which also goes in 10% in increments. Communications can be your primary one for uh, picking up speech and just kind of stuff in the outside world. You can turn on Clarity Boost. That just makes voices even clearer. Uh, so if you're in a crowded room and you really want to hear what the person in front of you is saying, that's what you want to have on. Obviously, I'm in a quiet environment, so it's not quite going to use the automatic scene detection to determine on you know, which of these modes is best. Uh, but So you do also have... Sennheiser's Advanced Speech Enhancement Technology, uh, which is really what makes this all work. Uh, it separates language, 
uh, whether that be English or really any language uh, that is a distinct dialect and voice, or uh, any language used uh, via voice, it'll be able to pick that up and detect that and separate it from the environment around so it makes it easier to hear and clearer as well. Uh, these are also optimized for media streaming, so it's kind of a, a one device to do it all, so you don't have to get headphones that work with your hearing aids or take your hearing aids out to put in earbuds to then put your hearing aids back in. Uh, they are optimized so you get an excellent sound quality, uh, automatically enhance it, enhances speech, music, movies, adapts based on what you're listening to so that you can get the best possible quality, um, as well as improved phone calls. Uh, so the active noise canceling blocks out any sort of distracting background noises while focusing on the actual voice that's coming through your, coming through on your call. Put these back in the charging case here. Oh no, it's disconnected. And then when we pull them out, you can see how long it takes to connect. Well, that's not promising. Your bud connection failed, but green, here we go. And communication mode activated right away. Uh, right in the top right corner, you've got your battery level indicators, both at 99%. Um, you can click on the earbuds, pull up the different controls here, uh, based on communications, relax mode, and stream mode, which is going to be things like increase decrease sound level uh, for the streamed audio, for external noises, um, switching between different modes with long presses, and then doing things like tapping for play pause and your assistant. And it looks like they're all pretty much the same and same kind of things with incoming calls. And you, it, yeah. All right. Uh, firmware update, which looks like these ones do have one. I'm gonna, no, I'm gonna wait on that. Uh, support and then your profile, uh, whether it be your account information, data that they use, privacy policies, you can go in there and set all that up. Plus you can also change your sound profile. And uh, so the Sennheiser Conversation Plus earbuds, or hearing aid earbuds, the Sennheiser, uh, the Sennheiser Conversation Clear Plus hearing aid earbuds offer up to a nine hour battery life on a single charge and boast up to 18 hours of additional battery life with the case. So that's two additional full charges. Um, and the case is pretty small too. So um, I don't know, GoPro Hero 10 for scale, I guess. Now I have anything else up here. Here we go. Uh, bib board for scale, might not have that. Uh, but anyways, yeah, very small, very compact. Uh, so this will easily be something you can throw into a pocket when you're going out. So if you, you feel like you don't need them in your ears or if it's you know, an environment that um, just feel you don't need them and then all of a sudden you do, you'll have them with. Uh, so very easy and compact, plus it's the actual charger too. Uh, something that I kind of disliked about some other ones is the case to charge in is not the same as the carry case um, and has no built-in battery or so yeah do like no built-in battery built-in battery uh, you can see that there's there's definitely some value in having one that uh, having a carrying case that is nice and compact easy to use easy to carry with you um, as well as not leaving it at home and then ending up without a left hearing aid anymore, or just you don't, you're not gonna fit this in your pocket. That's why the all day clears come with this, which does no charging, but holds them very securely and comfortably. But so these are, yeah, so far so good. Um, I will test these out, um, take them for a couple of walks, a couple of runs. It's definitely hat season here in uh, Milwaukee, Wisconsin, so We'll kind of see how it works out with that, uh, how they work with glasses. I don't see them interfering with glasses because like, they're earbuds. They're not really gonna, you don't have to worry about the arms of your glasses hitting them. But I'll put them through the ringer and uh, kind of touch back in with my thoughts on them um, through a variety of different, different things. Plus it's right around the holidays, so I uh, might actually be able to test these out depending on how long I take in between uh, recording this and 
kind of coming up with my final thoughts. But anyways, this has been the Sennheiser Conversation Clear Plus True Wireless Hearing Solution with Speech Enhancement and Active Noise Cancellation um, in black. And yeah, it's definitely in black. Um, comes with everything you need to get started uh, except for a smartphone, uh, which you probably already have, especially if you're watching this. Very easy to set up, very compact, lightweight solution. Um, and yeah, thank you so much for watching today. Um, I'll have links down in the description below for these and the other kind of hearing solutions that I had shown in this video. Um, if you like them, uh, I definitely appreciate if you use those links. I earn a small commission, costs you nothing more, um, and in some cases on some of my other partner and affiliate links. Uh, uh, but thank you so much for watching today, and you have a great day.